Hi Leo, welcome to my channel. This is a love connection reading session for you, Leo. I hope you're fine. I hope you're well. The reading for today, Leo, is for the first week of June 2020. And this is applicable for singles, couples in a relationship, dating, or getting to know. And this is for the Leo friends out there, okay? What can you get for Leo? What is the intuitive love message for Leo? In today's reading, Leo, I'm going to be looking at the past situation for you. Past situation. Um, your energy. The mutual energy between you and your person. And your person's energy. And then I'm going to get... Um, ooh, you've got the two of cups. Advice and outcome. Okay? So, if I'm going to... Ex I don't, I'm not yet sure whether I'm going to extend it. But I'll let you know, depending on the message. Okay? That I would relay. So, let's start your reading, Leo. Leo, Leo. Um, so, the past situation for you, Leo, is you've got the Nine of Wands in upright position in the Moon card. And the Empress card. There's a possible breakup in here, Leo. Or separation or a very messy it's a very messy fight or some sort of nasty words or verbal abuse but something is something destructive for some of you or something blown out of proportion because it made you defensive or your person defensive or scared okay like for some of you i felt like you, you don't feel hopeful that you would still reconcile like you, you burn the bridges for some of you guys. Something messy because the the emperor the empress card is in reverse. This is you know you're not taking care of yourself. You're it's not looking good. It's not looking healthy. And then next to the empress card is the moon. You could be dealing with the cancer or this could be the month of June. But it's pretty clear that you guys is in a breakup mode or in a messy situation. Something that it is quite complicated or. It's not easy to fix. And then someone is very defensive. It could be you. It could be them. But they're very defensive. Very guarded. Also, I sense tired. This is a wounded wire. I'm tired. I'm, I'm saying 2-2-2. Two, two, two. Okay? 2 minutes and 22 seconds when I said I'm tired. So, I don't know. It could be you. It could be them. But I feel like the past situation for you was kind of draining. Someone damaged something. Someone trust or issue or... I don't know, possessiveness, or it's just, it's it's a choke. It's a choker. That's what I'm getting in here. So that's the past situation for you, past energy. And then you've got here, your energy is the Knight of Cups. You could be upset because they decline you, or you could be upset or angry or sad because you guys didn't level up or you didn't get the love, you know, Knight of Cups, or you don't want to share your love, or it could be, you're giving you're giving them your love and they're very defensive. On top of the knight of the knight the knight of cups is the nine of wands. So you're giving love, and what you're receiving from your person is crumbs. You know, they're you're, they're giving you. It's filtered, okay. You're giving your all to your person, and your person is giving you, a filtered or less of what you deserve, okay? Stingy, something like that. So. You're not happy about this, okay? Um, there's a there's some sort of confront confrontation that you did, or yeah, confrontation. But at the end, I felt like you and your person is both victim, like you're both wrong. At the end, no one wins. What I get from here, whether it's mostly your, it's whether it's their fault or your. It, no one no one wins in a heartbreak, okay? Both of you cry, lost, or sad. Because you're, you're losing a connection, okay? So, your, your person's energy is the knight of swords. They're not taking an action. They're ignoring you. They're, they just don't want to fight. They're tired, okay? Five of cups. So, you are sitting in an energy. Your person and yourself is sitting in an energy of five of cups. Lost, sadness, grief, breakup. Or you're simply missing your best friend. Or you're simply missing each other. Um, I really feel like you and your person needs to heal. You and your person needs to forgive. You and your person needs to take a bit of time to step back. And spend time alone. Because there is a bit of heavy energy in this reading. Okay? So... 
the strategy of your person is knight of swords i'm not gonna action now like i'm i'm not gonna be interactive with you because i'm sad um you're sad someone is sad okay it could be it could be them but i felt like it's both but your person's energy is that it's not ideal to action to reply to respond because we're just gonna end up fighting we're not gonna resolve so i'm gonna step back it will be very sad for me to do it but i need to heal i need to forgive i need to forget and you you're different you're knight of cups okay knight of cups in reverse so you're switching off your feelings towards your person your person is switching off their action okay you could still be communicating calling or texting them but you are not loving them or you're switching off loving them your person is it's not taking an action to your reply to your response or they're not giving you some verbal reply or they're not telling you their thought about the situation they don't want to tell you their thought of the next action because swords representative of thought process mental the logic so it's kind of stalemate so i yeah, really suggest that you take time to heal to forgive to forget and to focus yourself to inner healing because I don't like the five of cups. This is a sad card. Okay. You need to heal something inside of you that was broken or disappointed. Okay. And I think both of you are in pain. Okay. Both of you are suffering on this. Both of you, you know, nobody wins. That's what I get from here. Okay. Someone needs to heal. Okay. Before you move forward. In the immediate future, you've got here the two of cups. Okay. You've got the two of cups, the king of pentacles, and the hierophant, which is awesome card okay so right now leo there is no rush to rekindle to reconnect right away the more you and your person heal internally the more you and your person get into a better place and the more harmony peace and respect would be restored because i see and feel for some of you the way you talk with each other, the way you exchange texts, or the way you you make conversation, it's raising the voice, the texts are nasty. So if you're going through that direction of sending not so good texts, better not send that, you know. So I see that you and your, your, your person, you've got a future. You still have a commitment. Your person is a bit aloof still in the immediate future, but they will warm up, okay. So... Take this break, accept this break, this step back, this slow down, um, heal, you know, recuperate, find the strength again, be in the good vibe, you know, because I see you and your person having a two of cups moment. They will be responsible for their mistake and they will reinstall or re-offer you the commitment for some of you you'll get back to your wife to your husband to your long-term partner okay so there's a moment for you in the future that this would happen but right now since it was messy you're being advised to not rush things heal and find peace you know from in to outside so that when you meet or you talk all you have to do is admiration and love and forgiveness and happiness and sorriness with you and your person okay because i see this is your person they're taking accountability they will warm up you know it, it's gonna be a slow process for them to speak but they will warm up and they will help they will kind of be accountable that they will take ownership of the mistake and you know commitments is just in the background all right so this is Leo. This is you, Leo. Thank you for tuning in. Thanks for being here today. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope to see you soon. I hope I get a like, a subscribe, and um, don't forget to support my other channel if you're interested. Astro Style TV. The general reading for the month of June is already available in there. Check my website if you're interested for a private reading. Go to my website. Follow me on Instagram and have a great week. First week of June, we've got a new moon in Sag. So start manifesting your wishes, your goal personally and in love. Any sort of development. Okay? Thank you, Leo. Bye-bye.